Arsenal Fan TV uh, we're here with some guys that have come all the way up from Egypt for the game today. What did you make of it? First of all, uh, it's really good to see you again. Uh, we did an interview with you like a uh, long time ago. Oh, I was without the beard, yeah. so. And I like your jacket, by the way. It reminds oh, me of the five win uh, <laughs> defeat. And uh, yeah, the, we were very excited to come because it's uh, our first uh, North London Derby ever. What did you so, make of the North London Derby? Uh, I, mean, I mean, you think we were a bit lucky to get something out of it? I was very disappointed with the performance, to be honest. Uh, mm. I'm glad I missed the first half because I came a bit late, so. And the second half was even worse. Good look. <laughs> the second half was even worse. Uh, I don't know what happened, to be honest. Uh, mm. Arsene Wenger did all the, the wrong substitutions. Even Gibbs, I know Gibbs scored the, the goal, but still, he didn't do enough. I yeah, think but who else we, is he going to bring on? Who else? I mean, I, we, you, yeah, know, you, you look at, the, you look yeah. at what he's got available on there. Is yeah. there anyone That's else he could have brought on? Yeah, I think the Flamini and Cazola substitution, it was a good one because Cazola was so bad today. And Flamini, when he came, uh, he and Coughlin, they dominated the midfield, which yeah. we lacked in the first half. So that give, uh, give us a, a bit pace in the midfield. And we yeah. controlled and we dominated in the last 30 minutes. That was the good thing. But however, it was still a disappointment that we didn't win. But one, one point is better than nothing. We need a new signings as well uh, during the next fa the phase. Uh, because the bench was empty and we ne need some new strikers to make to be a turning point for the game. And uh, other than this, the performance was not uh, quite. Any good, any good strikers in Egypt? Because I. That's a mercy. No, I, I doubt there is a other good strikers. Uh, Mohamed Salah in Roma might be a good deal yeah. next winter. We have Ahmed Metab also. He's good. But he's like 35. So but I know Asif Wenger usually likes to get players that are a bit old. Yeah. No. I think he's too busy with the photo shoot of GQ these days. <laughs> he's turning into a model. Yeah. It was a shitty performance, to be honest. Right, <laughs> listen, came from another continent. From I'm going to ask you finally. I'm going to ask you finally. Can also win the league this yeah, season? Yeah, I'm optimistic this year. So yes. yeah, I yeah, I hope unless we buy, we can win it uh, unless we buy a striker because uh, Giro today was so bad. Yes, like him. Unless we're buying a new striker, yeah. I doubt. Last time together, uh, there's a lot of improvements. Yeah, we took the cup two years and uh, in a row. And I think we're going to take the league this year. We hope. Really he was in Nigeria in a prayer ground, praying, <laughs> getting anointing oil. I saw this on the KG. He was praying. Even my pastor in Leeds, Pastor Ralph, has been praying that he doesn't get sacked. So since they are praying that he doesn't get sacked, I will have to change my tactics. And please advise, just beg Morio, please resign. 